On a scale of one to 10, with one being the worst ever and 10 being the best possible, how would you personally rate your childhood? I'd say about a seven. Okay. What uh what would have needed to happen for you to have say eight or nine? Uh probably my mom not being on drugs and me having to live with my father and and, and my stepmother. Right. Like being forced to live with your right. with, with your dad. It wasn't your choice. Right. Okay. And that that story is wild because like even still thinking about it, like, were your clothes already packed in the co- like at your dad's house? Um no, actually, he bought me an all-new wardrobe. So you never even went home to pack? No. No toys, no video games, nothing? No. And actually, yeah, no, no, nothing at all. Okay. Just had to get up and go. Got it, got it, got it. So, yeah, that was that was a life, that was an early life, life lesson for you. Like, things can be taken away in an instant. Sometimes we have no control over it. Yeah. And, and to learn that as a kid, it could be traumatic depending on the type of child you are. Right. And actually, like I said, it was bittersweet because although I went over there and I didn't have any clues, it was like almost like, uh, what movie was that? I can't remember the movie, but the kid was like enamored because they in a in a department store, they're getting all new stuff. I think it was like Orphan Annie or something like that. Okay. My dad took me. And, you know, even though now Foreman Mills is like, ah, oh, you go to Foreman Mills. But back then it was like, whoa. I'm going to going to Foreman Mills, J.C. Penny. Right. I'm getting new jeans and oh, I'm gonna be fresh in hats. Like, right. <laughs> <laughs> you ain't gonna be able to tell me nothing. Right. 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 <laughs> <laughs> no holes in my clothes. I'm, I'm I'm feeling good. Right. Okay. 